So, Adrian, um, so much good stuff. I mean, it's such a fun interview, right? Yeah, yeah. I keep thinking, how could I pull off telling people I'm a sloth? I don't think I could do it. I don't have <laughs> or, a good... Uh, or a snake. Or, or uh, I, Yeah, there's a lot of kind of animals you wouldn't want. Yeah, A shark. She said, I wouldn't go with shark. <laughs> no, no. I remember somebody answering in their interview. A uh, hiring manager told me, this guy told me he was like... He asked, I asked that question. He says, I'm a monkey. I like to bounce all around and stuff. And he says, six months later, he was a monkey. He was in everybody's business. And that's what monkeys do, right? <laughs> you know, well, been, yeah. Well. And, and when he started throwing his feces, that's when they let him go. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I, I do love that. I'm a scorpion. Really? I Then I don't think you're right for, for yeah, this guy. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. I, I love that she has done all this research and yeah. there's these four identities. Find right. out which one you are and be yourself. You yeah. know, don't. Don't memorize perfect answers. Don't go in yeah. thinking that there is a right answer. It's you're selling yourself. And yeah. that is such great advice. And don't try to be a charmer if you're not. Right. I remember losing a big job once because, you know, they said, ah, the guy we hired, he, he was the guy you most would want to go to a party with. Well, no, I'm not going to be that guy. I, I'm thinking more about it. I'm more of a challenger. I want to be, I want to be qualified. I want to be heard. I want to ask tough questions. You know, that's, that's where I come in, but we are who we are. And so I think you're, you're right. Be who you are and, and play to your strengths. Yeah. Nobody gives you the best offer out of the box. I thought yeah. that was, just, she goes, and by the way, just ask, is this negotiable? Yeah. I say, well, can you ask that? So, yes, they want to hire you. Yeah. Right. They've gone through all these people. They've landed on you and everything's negotiable. And if it's not salary, look for something else. Exactly. Such great advice. And we've been caught in that trap a hundred times, you know, no, yeah. Uh, sure. Yeah. Well, how much you yeah. got? Fine. I'll take it. You know. Well, and I like this too. ask the, the same questions in the same environment, make it's like, uh, you know, trying to hire a violinist for the symphony. They use screens, right? They don't, they you don't see the person. And there's right. a reason for that is you don't want to be biased. Well, ask the same questions, same environment, get your team to interview them. So you don't fall into our trap where, where we didn't really listen to our team. Boy, did we after that, you know, every interview, uh, interviewer, we, we asked our team and listened to what they thought. I liked your advice for interviewers as well. Uh, don't talk too much, yeah. you know, ask the question, listen, right? Yeah. You should be talking 20% of the time, not 80% of the time. And then lastly, for me, it was, was kind of interesting when she said, uh, I don't have any kind of like um, practices or meditate. You know, we've so many mm -hmm. times in our podcast, it's, it's going for a walk, it's meditating. So she goes, I'm type A. You know, my, <laughs> I work. I, work yeah. uh, I, I like to work. And uh, that's my, that's my medicine. Yeah. And again, being so genuine, good for yeah. her. You know, she could have said, yeah, I meditate for three hours a day. And then, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, she was a charmer, and that's why charmers, yeah, kind of spark with other charmers. And so, yeah, I love that. Hey, uh, this has been so great. We have such interesting guests here. We learned so much. So we want to thank Anna for being on the show today. A big thanks to our producer, Brent Klein, to Christy Lawrence, who helps us find amazing guests like this, and to all of you who listened in. If you like the podcast, please download it, share it with friends. And we'd also love you to visit thecultureworks.com for some free resources to help you and your team thrive. And we love to speak to audiences all over the world, you know, whether it's virtually or in person, whether you're doing a leadership team retreat or you've got everybody uh, all hands on deck. We, we love to speak about gratitude, about uh, anxiety and re resilience in the workplace, about culture and, of course, leadership and teams. So give us a call. We would love to speak to your event. Well, Adrian, uh, we laughed through the whole interview. It was uh, so engaging, so fun. Nice. I'll let you uh, have the last word and wrap us up. You bet. Don't forget to pick up our book, Anxiety at Work, to help with you and your team. Uh, until next time, we wish you the best of mental health.